Greetings and welcome to the Thursday Afternoon Vodcast podcast. You want to see my package? you Billy Bubbles, 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 Toils and Troubles. How are all you Billy Bumblers doing out there today? Sorry about that. I was choking on my water a little bit. I received a package in the mail today, but before we get into that, there was something I wanted to talk about. Oh, the Oreo, the intergalactic extraterrestrial Oreo. Earlier today, uh, Oreo released this, uh, I don't know if it's a viral campaign. I don't know what the fuck you call it. Some kind of campaign, you know, when they lightning deals or something like that. I don't know. Whatever you want to call it. Oreo announced that you could get free limited edition Oreos. Um, and you only had to pay $3 shipping. You could only get one, but it was $3 shipping. Now, from what I've been told, there is only 3,000 of them, and my order went through, so I'm keeping my fingers crossed that we actually end up getting one. The deal with them is, with all the talk of UFOs and aliens and stuff lately, uh, with so much more coming out, they want us to use the hashtag Oreo Offering and place... The package on the, on the, here's a picture of the package, by the way. You place it on the ground, you place an Oreo in the center as an offering up to our alien brethren. I think it's, I think it's a brilliant fucking campaign. I just wish it was a different flavor because then we would have been faced with the decision of do we open the package and try them or do we just leave it and, you know, sell it for a fortune, you know, 20 years from now. I don't think I ever want to buy 20 year old Oreos. Hang on a second. Later that same evening. Uh, what the hell were we just talking about? Um, yeah, the Oreo. So that'll be fun. Hopefully I, hopefully it really is limited to 3000 because I would feel very, I don't know, special in a way <laughs> to have received these Oreos. I just happen to be faster than, I don't know, the rest of the planet that wanted them. Uh, so as soon as they come here, I will, I'll show you all what they're about. And we're definitely going to have a video planned for them. A very interesting and fun video. So for now... Let's use our new knife and cut into this box. See, I know who this is from and I know where it came from. So, to the best of my knowledge, I know what's in here. However, it could be a shit cake. So I'm going to be very delicate with opening this just in case. And I'll thank the individual after I've opened it, but I don't want to disclose anything in case I'm wrong. I have been known to make mistakes from time to time. Oh, this cuts really nice. I didn't know how well this knife was going to cut because... It's really not, like, listen, it's not the best thing in the world. It's $12.99, and it does this, you know? That's cool. <laughs> it's fun to play with, I can tell you that much. All right, let's bust in here, okay. Let me see if there's any notes. I oftentimes, I'll just completely skip. I don't want to read part of this, though, because... <laughs> okay, I can thank him now. Uh, you've probably already seen the back of this, and you know what it is. But I just want you to, <laughs> I just want you to read this. Awesome. <laughs> you know, the funny thing is, is that I'm assuming it came directly from the company. So chances of him actually have, having fired it in. I'm assuming this came from the factory. So the chances of him actually having fired it in this. And either way, I'm going to wash it anyway, because, um, I don't know. <laughs> That's what you do when you get a new like thing, right? You you wash it. If you go to if you go to like the dollar store and buy some glasses, you bring them home and you all right. Let me just get into this so we can see. Oh, hot damn! That is fancy. That's purple. That's my purple. See, everything I have is purple. Look at purple, purple. My shorts are well, they they're more of a wineish purple. Needless to say, I like the color purple. It's one of my favorites. I have a very personal attachment to it. So this came from my friend Corey. You know this, Corey. I'm going to give you the Jesus boner. Jesus boners. J -j Jesus boners. Jesus boners. J -j -j Jesus boners. Or this Corey. Is to make sure you eat this fucking chip. They're going to eat the fucking chip. And then you can put your little box up as a trophy. Or perhaps you're more familiar with this, Corey. Also, make sure you got something to spit that bitch out on. And lest we forget this, Corey. Jay, you remember that time I told you to get off your ass and do what you're going to do? I if do. you just had in the minutes a few. I have it recorded. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's Corey. He's my buddy. Uh, he is one of the individuals who I'm working with currently on creating a new web series. Uh, I, I'm lax to call it a podcast. It is something, it's developed into something else. I don't want to say too much, though. Um, however, it has grown, and it's, it's still in the works. I don't want you guys to think that we've forgotten about it. But we're moving at our pace, and we're happy with our pace. So when it's ready, it'll be ready. But it will be ready someday. Hopefully within the next, like, you know, two, three months at most. End of year, maybe. I don't know, maybe it's a Christmas present. Anywho, Corey, thank you so much. You didn't have to do this. Um... I really appreciate it, though. So I have a nice one now because Carol had a nice one and I had all the cheap ones. <laughs> but I will cherish this for all times. Um, and if you love Yeti, um, what, what do you call these? And if you love the Yeti Rambler Tumblr as much as I love the Yeti Rambler Tumblr, then please consider liking, commenting, subscribing, sharing. Hit the little bell icon. Oh, and Nicole, I haven't forgotten. What you shouldn't have done is gone to Mexico and left your house all alone. I hope you enjoy the rest of your vacation. Take care of each other out there and don't forget to make somebody smile. I'm Jason Oliver and I'll catch you guys in the next episode of the Vodcast Podcast. Take care and boy howdy. 